Hey guys, welcome to the next map that I'm going to play, which is Gal Mountains version 8, which was requested actually by a viewer, and I was like, sure, why not? So I looked this one up, and here we go. Oh, look at this! This looks like a trench or hallway. It is not, though. Oh, this looks interesting. Well, okay, one thing you can already notice that this map will not win the prize for most beautiful map, but it is very interesting looking. Did those guys just kill themselves? Did they commit suicide? No, they... Well, it's pretty difficult actually to see where the edge is. Oh, this is interesting. So, hmm, I'm definitely intrigued by the layout of this map. Like I said, in terms of how it looks, it looks shitty. There's no denying that. I mean, this this looks ugly. But it has something very fun with the the narrow space that that you find on, and we are being fucking owned over here. Uh, obviously, this is only infantry based. Uh, no vehicles and no cover. This actually. But multiple levels, so as you can see, you can have some weird fights where you, where one squad is fighting up a path or fighting up a mountain while being bombarded from above. I think with um with other players, this map can actually be quite fun since you can also drop from incredible height to maybe flank them. Okay, that didn't work. Obviously, because there, there, there's such a tight space, uh, hero units are of incredible value. Also, grenades will be very, very valuable since they will uh, scatter the enemy and let them fall off the edge and instantly kill them. Man, this is, this is chaos. It is weird because it is actually a little bit of a little bit tactical, though. It, it is also though the 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 rule that if you have more manpower on there, that's great. The jet trooper also is more valuable here. Yeah, fuck you. I mean, the thing here is you you are um, nowhere is safe. From every point you can be shot. Snipers are incredibly powerful on this map. Yeah, we are getting our asses kicked over here. I am surprised though that the AI actually also just jumps off the the, the cliff to a lower So wait a minute, can I actually make that? Can I go up here? Oh look at this. See, this is interesting. Did, did this, this add something? In terms of critique, like I said, the map looks like shit. It is a very interesting idea with narrow corridors like this, especially because they could have just had narrow corridors, but like closed corridors. You would have a different kind of strategy because if you would, for example, uh, throw grenades, they... Well, it still will do a lot of damage, but... They will not be blown off, you know, the edge. And uh, also, uh, jet troopers and heroes will not be that uh, overpowered there. Or, well, maybe they're not overpowered, but they're definitely way more valuable here. Well, in terms of that, I, I would like I would have liked to see more original, I don't know, art or design in terms of how it looks. It is very basic though. I think a lot uh, some people will also uh, you know not like that from this map. Uh, it is not a map that I will probably play again. Um, playing with friends might actually you know add a lot of stuff since there are a lot of people who just like the basic stuff where they want to shoot. And there is some um, like I said Though the strategy here is mostly like having more firepower, you can have some strategy with these slopes that you can jump off from. 
or jump off and uh, with the use of hero units, well, we might actually win. I think I think my AI units are stuck somewhere and the droids cannot find them. Oh no. Okay, but guys, as always, down link is in the description. We are about to lose. And I will see you guys. Well, we're still playing for some reason. Okay, I will see you guys next time.